Last year, in the middle of summer, in Las Vegas of all places, God tells me to buy our kids winter coats. It's time to move, right? So long story short, we arrive in Colorado, October 14th. And after two weeks of settling, I remember shoveling some snow in our driveway and God tells me it's time to take a sabbatical. And I'm like, sabbatical, hold on. It's almost like he orchestrated this elaborate plan just so I could rest, just so I could rest. And, and keep in mind, I have been in ministry now for 10 years, right? Advancing the kingdom, serving communities, and was right in the early phases of planting a network of house churches. And God tells me to take the rest of the year off, the rest of the year off. And I realized that if, if I couldn't rest and trust God as the sustainer of my work, then I was working out of my own ability. So I shut it all up. I shut it all down. No sermons, no discipleship, no planning. It was beautiful and refreshing while at the same time it was ugly and frustrating, right? I had to come face to face with my reality and I couldn't hide any longer behind productivity, behind distractions. I had to accept that my identity, right? My true self is not found in what I do, but what I do is the natural flow of who I am. This is the key to it, right? And without slowing down, I never would have received the invitation to be still. And without stopping, I never would have taken the time to read this letter, right? That God was patiently waiting to communicate with me. He was patiently waiting. So what happened? I got healthy. I took walks with God. I spent intentional time with my family. I prioritized relationships over productivity. I learned to say yes and no. And I learned the wisdom between the two. And I learned that intentional rest is a lifestyle choice, right? God is inviting us to enjoy this. And right now he's saying, come away with me. Come on, learn the unforced rhythms of grace. There are things I want to show you, but you must be still in order to learn this, right? So I want you to join us Monday evenings for six weeks. It's a live online interactive course on Sabbath, a leader's guide to rest. Okay, that's Monday evenings starting March, March 1st. I'm really excited to uh, launch this and share this journey with you guys. I'm looking forward to seeing you there.